This is Eric from Creatables and I'm going to show you how to re reverse engineer and build an umbrella with straw bees. Okay, you need a long straw. You can make that with two regular straws at home or something like that. There's tons of ways of achieving this. We have these long straws here because we found a store that has them. Uh, you need five medium long straws and then you need ten of the shorter straws. And the exact proportions aren't really important. You can just you can just make you know, find out your own versions of this. You'll see why later. But basically, one long straw, five medium, and ten short. Uh, the next thing you need is twelve regular straw bees, and five double straw bees, and two five-legged straw bees. So, we start building with the long straw, and a single straw bee. Take the single straw bee, put it in there, like that. Next step is taking the five-legged one and putting it on the straw, like this. And here comes the trick with the straw bees and how you use them in general. You press it on, hold pretty close to the notch of the straw bee and press it in. And then it clicks into that groove. Then I usually do something like this, spin it a little bit to make it attached to the groove. And now we can be a little bit preparing for, for the next step, so we can actually bend these straws a little, uh, bend these legs of the five-legged piece. We could almost have done that before, you see, sometimes you come up with ideas when you start describing how you do things. And I don't really remember how I do it, but... So this is the basic thing. You get this, the starting point just so we know where we're heading. The next step is to take the single straw bees, two single straw bees and one of these, two single straw bees and one double. And then you attach them like so, and you once again you see the trick, it's like holding on the side of the straw bee, holding this straw bee pretty close, clicking it in, whoops, <laughs> clicking it in, and then attaching it again. What? It's because I'm watching the camera, so I'm losing the... <laughs> so this is it. Now we're going to build five of these. These are the mechanical parts of the umbrella. Last one. Now we have these five pieces, uh, we attach the uh, small straws to these five pieces and I'm going to show you how. And as usual with the straw bees, squeeze them gently, it's much easier to get them on. These straws are pretty small so they're a bit different. So you squeeze them on like that. And there we're done. The next step is to uh, attach these to this top part here. So I take one of these, and this is a bit tricky. This is something you're going to get used to when you build with strawberries, is that being knowing the difference of when you need them to be perpendicular to each other or when they need to be in the plane. Uh, or like level with each other. This is level and this is perpendicular. In this particular case we want the mechanics to be here, so we want them to be vertical. So I'll put it, squeeze it on, see if we can get focus here. So I squeeze it on there and make sure it's perpendicular so you can see it's pretty good. That makes it possible to make this mechanical motion. So then I do this with all the sides. And there we have it. 
thingy. Doesn't look like much now. So next step is to add this. And before you add it, make sure you bend these knees so they're much easier to attach as you get the mechanical properties out of them. So next you take the piece you just bent, put it on like that, and in this step you make sure to add them, just connect them like this. As usual it's good to squeeze, push it in, push it in, There we are, the basic core structure of the umbrella. And now you can figure out what to do with the rest, but I'm going to show that anyway. Just attach them, like this. And there we are, the umbrella. See what it looks like. And I usually finish off with uh, just one of these in the bottom so you can hang it from your roof or something like that. If you have some more pieces um, you can add little yellow pieces to the ends just to show this. And there we are.